Here's the deal. No matter how much a girl wants you, she will rarely make the first move to kiss you. Instead, she's going to give you signs of her attraction, hoping that you have the confidence to kiss her. And most guys completely miss or overlook these signs and lose opportunities with women to go in for that kiss. And I don't want you to be one of those guys. So in this video, I'm going to show you the seven most common signs that a woman is feeling attracted to you and wants you to kiss her. So pay attention and look out for these signs with women so you can confidently make the first move. I'm Marnie and from here on out, I am going to be your very own personal wing girl. Every week, I will give you the no BS insider info about what women really want versus what they say they want, plus the most effective methods to win over any woman you like. So just hit that subscribe button so that you never miss a video. Let's get into this. Here are the seven signs a woman feels attracted to you and wants you to kiss her. Sign number one, she holds eye contact and glances at your lips. When a woman is interested in you, she will usually try to hold eye contact with you, but also look down at your lips, glance for a second, and then go back up to your eyes. So if she's shy, she might not make a lot of eye contact, but she will make a point of glancing at your lips to show that she is interested. This is almost like an involuntary reaction we ha women have when feeling really attracted to a guy, like a reflex reaction. And yes, it's super subtle and you might not always catch it, but that's why there are other signs to look for as well like sign number two, biting or licking your lips. If you're talking to a woman and she is biting her lip in a girly way or licking her lips in a flirty way, then you can't get a more obvious sign than that. Do not doubt yourself when women show you this signal. It is the most obvious sign of all. When we bite or lick our lips in a suggestive way, we are essentially saying, I'm turned on right now and I want you. It's an as obvious as a sign as you'll get. So just letting you know, it's not like you sh they show in the movies where it's like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like really overt. It's more of like a subtle thing. It's really just bringing attention to her lips. She's trying to draw you to look at her lips to start thinking about kissing. That said, I need to point out something important. Not all women show the exact same signs of attraction. So not all girls are going to show you the biting her lips or licking her lips signal to you. When at interacting with a woman that you want to kiss, you should be on the lookout for any of the signals in this video, but don't be worried if she doesn't show all of the signals during her interaction with you. If you focus too much on the signs, you will overthink things, get stuck in your head, and then become come across as nervous and self-doubting. And obviously, the more signs she shows you, the higher the chances are that she wants you to kiss her. A part of being good with women is being confident enough to make a move on one or two of the signals that she gives you. So that, that boldness and confidence itself is what's going to turn her on like crazy. So keep that in mind. Before we move on to the next sign to look out for, I wanna tell you about one more thing you definitely need to be prepared for with women. Once you easily start spotting the signs that she wants to be kissed, you'll need to spot the signs she wants more and make sure that you and your penis are good and ready. Which is why I wanna tell you about today's video sponsor, Joy Mode. Joy Mode makes natural and science-backed sexual wellness products for men. Joy Mode was created because the products in the market, like prescription drugs and over-the-counter gas station pills, are terrible and can hurt you in the long run. I would much rather you take a supplement designed to spice things up naturally rather than a prescription drug that can have very harmful effects on you down the road. Whether you're happy or unhappy with your performance in the bedroom, why not perform even better? Joy Mode's sexual performance booster is like, it's like a pre-workout, but for sex. You take it anywhere from 45 minutes to five hours before you have sex and you can expect to have one of your best erections. So if you wanna spice things up in the bedroom and boost your sexual performance and do it naturally without prescription drugs, then give Joy Mode a try. Use joymode.com slash Marnie or enter Marnie at checkout for 20% off your first order. That is joymode.com slash Marnie for 20% off your first order. Thank you, Joy Mode, for sponsoring today's video. All right, on to the third sign that she wants to be kissed. Sign number three, she regularly is touching you or playfully hitting you. When we don't like a guy, don't feel any sexual attraction for him and don't want to give him any signals that we are interested in him sexual in a sexual way, we avoid touching him. We don't want to give him the impression that it's okay 
to touch each other. So we try to minimize physical contact as much as possible, which means if a woman is regularly touching you, it reveals that she is comfortable with that sort of physical contact between you and that she has some degree of sexual attraction for you. So you have to believe in yourself and go with the moment. In most cases, a woman won't wanna make it any more obvious than showing you how comfortable she is with you physically. She doesn't wanna have to guide you through the process and instead expects you to have the confident confidence to act on her signals. Sign number four, submissive looks. During sex, it's the man who penetrates the woman. The woman opens up and receives the man. It's an act of submission. And if the man displays a high degree of masculinity and leadership, she enjoys the feeling of submitting to him. So this means when a woman gives you submissive eyes, like dipping her chin down and looking up at you in a girly way, or just acting like really feminine and petite and girly when she's interacting with you, she's instinctively trying to communicate to you, I like you, I'm turned on, I'm ready to be kissed. It is then up to you as a man to make a move and be that man. Like for instance, put your arm around her, lower back and draw her into you. Then look in her eyes and then start kissing her. If you don't have the confidence to do that, let's look at another sign that a woman wants you to make a move. Sign number five, playing with her hair or her necklace. Now I'm not saying that when you're interacting with a woman and she casually readjusts her necklace, that means she wants you to kiss her or plays with her hair, right? What I'm saying is when you are talking to a woman and she is constantly playing with her hair or necklace in a really girly way, then she's feeling attracted to you. And if you were to confidently make your move, she will most likely happily follow your lead. Sign number six, she is open to you touching her. If a woman is not sexually interested in you and doesn't want to show you any signs of interest, she usually isn't going to be open to your touch. If you put your hand on her leg or put your arm around her, like some women may be very aggressive and say like, hey, no need to touch, like get away. Or she will look really uncomfortable and then distance herself from you, like tense up and distance. However, if you're talking to a woman and you put your arm around her lower back, touching her on the shoulder, playing with her hair while talking to her, and she reacts in a positive way, like getting more feminine, then it's a clear signal that she is sexually attracted to you and is open to you kissing her. Sign number seven, she primps herself for you. So when it comes to what women do to show you that we want you to kiss us, one of the signs is that we will primp ourselves to look better for you. To primp means to make slight adjustments to one's hair, makeup, clothes, et cetera, to look better. And we know that men are primarily attracted to our looks before anything else. So if a woman is feeling attracted to you and she wants you to like her and make a move, kind of like I'm doing right now, she might do a quick adjustment to make herself more attractive. She might fix her top to readjust her breast, to show better cleavage to you. She might also put on or reapply some lipstick or lip gloss to make her lips look more appealing. She might excuse herself to the washroom and adjust her hair or her makeup. In essence, she will do these little things to enhance her appearance as much as possible, like even brightening, widening her eyes. It's a solid signal that she has sexual attraction towards you and is open to you making a move and going for a kiss. Once again, like I said earlier, not all women will show you all these signals. So most of the time, you will have to act on one or two of these alone. That said, the better you are with women, the less a woman can control herself from showing these signs of interest, IOIs as some people call them. If you can make women feel in intensely attracted and turned on, she will give you more and more of these signs. And if you want to know how to get a woman uncontrollably turned on as fast as possible, you should click the link in the description below the second link and check out the F formula. The F formula tells you exactly what to say to a woman to put, to make her putty in your hands. It gives you countless word for word examples for flirty things to say to any woman. If you have always struggled to flirt with women and tend to play it safe in conversations, then the F formula is for you. It teaches you how to flirt and it will turn you into a natural flirt who can give a woman butterflies and get her excited and turned on with your words and your ways of being. Click the link in the description to check it out. Okay, thousands of my students have used the lines and techniques inside the F formula to date and be with amazing women. And there's no reason why it can't do the same for you. So click the link in the description box, check it out. If you like it, go get it. Lastly, thank you for watching this video to the very end. I hope you found it useful. And as always, I will see you next week.